What's up, everyone? It's White Gamer. Today, we have the best goalkeeper you can use. Shout out to H. Jota for giving me his goalkeeper built. So, for your position, you're going with goalkeeper. Now, guys, for height, he uses 6'2". I know it's going to be small for a lot of you guys, but we're going to go with 6'4", just for the sake of the video. But he uses 6'2", but we're going to go with 6'4". For weight, he uses 185 pounds. And for his goalkeeper game settings, as you guys can see it right now, he has save assistance on semi. So now everyone, now we have the play styles. Now I'm going to go in order because I know not everyone's high level. So first one I recommend going with quick reflex. The second one will be footwork. The third one I recommend you guys to use is the cross claimer. A lot of people are crossing because crossing is a little OP. This will allow you to intercept crosses, which is really good. And then the fourth one, rush out. And then for your fifth one, everyone, I recommend you guys using aerial. Now, this is going to be good. So when someone, uh, especially for corner kicks, so your pro can jump higher. And then the last one I recommend is the long ball. So everyone, if you're higher rated, then have your play styles like this. The far reach, the far throw, the long ball pass, the cross claimer, the rush out, and then the aerial. Now, once you get to level 25, you will have your first slot on lock. Um, but the quick reflexes, I think this is one of the last ones you get. But I highly recommend you guys to have this one as soon as you unlock it. But um, I think the first ones you get for goalkeeper might be the cross claimer. So go with the cross claimer for the goalie. But once you get to the higher levels, guys, go with your footwork plus and then go with quick reflex plus. So eventually, once you get to the high levels, have your play style plus be quick reflexes and footwork and then everything else. Uh, the regular play styles just make sure they're like this so this is how you want your play styles now for your skill tree everyone again i know not everyone's level 100 like me so the first couple of levels the first couple of skill points you get focus on your reflex and positioning guys so focus on your reflex and positioning then after that focus on your hand handling and diving and all that and then once you get more skill points guys make sure you get the wall reflex that's the first one you want to get the wall reflex then after you get even more higher in the level up, focus on your handling and all that. The kicking is going to be one of the last things you do, guys. Kicking is important as a goalkeeper, but it's not the main priority. So kicking will be one of the last things you fill out. So as you start getting more skill points, you want to then go with the jumping, guys. You want to get some jumping because this is going to be good for your pro when he's jumping to get the ball either on corner kicks or just on certain scenarios. And then eventually, everyone, you're going to want to fill this all out. You're going to want you get to your reactions maxed out, all this maxed out. Again, reactions maxed out. And then eventually, once you get more skill points, fill out the kicking because eventually you're going to fill out the whole goalkeeper. And then once you have your physical, the jumping maxed out, then we're going to focus on some acceleration. You do want to have some acceleration as a goalkeeper. This is going to help you when you're rushing out. Um, on one v one scenarios or rushing out to gra grab the ball, you you know you want to be able to accelerate quick, and then you'll get these three sprint speed here. And then for the passing, you are gonna add some passing to your goalkeeper, especially the vision, because the vision is gonna determine how accurate the short passes come or the long kick comes. Goalkeeper, so you're gonna get these three visions right here, and then these three long passing right here. Then for your last skill point, everyone, um, we just went with ball control. It's good to have good ball control when you know your teammates pass it back to you. So you make sure your keeper can control it properly. But yeah, everyone, this was the goalkeeper build. And we take a look overall, you're going to be a 95 rated goalkeeper. The most important thing here is the goalkeeping at 95. But yeah, everyone, again, shout out to Ace Jota. He uses this same exact build, except the height is a little bit different. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.